It's Thursday morning. What have you got on today? Um, chemistry, French, history, maths, and some geography. Oh, yeah. Okay. I always forget about geography. So I've just uh, dropped the car off at the garage down there. I was going to walk back home just to get the brake pads replaced. Uh, it's Thursday morning and actually it's meant to be dry but there's a little bit of drizzle, a bit of dark cloud there. So hopefully it won't get anything more than just drizzle. Uh, it's been dry this morning. It's about uh, 11 or 12 degrees at the minute, the temperature. So I was going to head up here and then I cut down the left, it's like a lane that goes past St Mary's School really, so I'm going to go down that way. Interesting piece of pruning going on at that tree there, I mean, we thought they'd gone that far, they might as well cut the stumps, otherwise it's just maybe a danger if they fall, maybe they're just in the process of doing it. Okay, so these, these nurseries here, uh, which is quite all right inside there's plenty of plants and all that in there like a lot of uh, greenhouses in different sections and uh, when we went in all the plants look very very top quality like really healthy looking in there and then you can see these fruit trees here all different types of fruit uh, of course it's just nobody's picking the fruit it's all just on the grass well i might show you i'll just walk in here and show you so swim car nurseries so yeah they've got like uh a lot of different plants, house plants and garden plants and shrubs and all sorts of stuff in in all these greenhouses and in the greenhouses there. But you can see all the fruit, it's just going to waste under each of these trees. Each one seems to be a different type of apple or pear or plum or whatever it happens to be. But it's all just going to waste, nobody's picking it. But yeah, so anyway, it's uh, quite close to us that, you know. Uh, those nurseries. Now you can see St Mary's High School down there, the red buildings. That's the back of it. So down there, so that's where they are. So we're directly opposite the school. So in terms of like walking distance, you can sort of get a, an idea of uh, how we are, just that we're up on the hill a bit up here. So the garage is just a couple of minutes down there. And uh, I'm just looping around the top here and then I'm gonna cut down a lane shortly the left and cut down that way so there's the school building St Mary's there see them back of it and this here this is a, a cemetery which is um, I think it's called Geisley Cemetery I wonder if that's its name that's here yeah Geisley Cemetery on the hillside they've got the railway line running along the valley bottom down there and there is a, a little stream which runs along as well behind the school and along that valley and actually it runs you can't see it but actually you can hear it and it runs behind the little Sainsbury shop uh, just down there and then it joins a tributary, it sort of fl flows down and round a bend and it goes and forms what's called LR Gill, which then runs down quite a steep section near where the, the council waste recycling centre is, down that way. So yeah. So we're coming to this little lane now. There is a uh, footpath which goes up the hill, up that way. But well, I'm just gonna go left down here so that'll bring us out where the ambulance station is basically uh, quite near the school at that junction down there head down there these just look like calves just look small these ones duck pond there in the farm property so I'm talking as well this is what the path is now it's gone from like a proper lane to just a little 
muddy path and then it opens out when you get to the railway line back to a path again proper proper uh, sort of wider gravelly path or road see the railway line quite clearly there now This is the bridge over the light railway line. I've only been walking for five minutes, it's not far at all. So there's this little lane now and it's basically right next to the school on the left uh, here and then on the right is the old cemetery for hyroids so when hyroids was in operation the, uh, the hospital that's the cemetery for it just behind that hedge there So we're heading down now from the school area just down the road. I've just passed the the, uh, the, the Peugeot car show room. And we're coming up this the Sainsbury's, the Sainsbury's local there. Uh, last night uh, <coughs> I just went to get a little bit of fuel in the garage. And as I was passed, it was about 10 o'clock. I pop just popped in and I uh, did get for 10 pence a couple of things like a, a sort of cheddar creamy coleslaw thing and then a pack of Warburton's bagels or something like that so maybe it's the I mean I've been going there see because Morrison's been doing the reductions earlier when I go past here there's some reductions but not a huge amount so maybe uh, they do it later in the evening like you know 9 10 o'clock anything left goes down to sort of tenpence so I might uh, pop in there you know now and again uh, later on and just see what there is so that's there that the same as local so the little river the little stream runs just behind here behind these little houses uh, when it's when it's not windy or when it's quiet you can hear the stream there's a railway line runs along there as well Uh, sort of you can hear it babbling away behind just behind behind this fence down the trees down there and then the railway line bends round and comes up where this goes underneath the road here where the bridge is just there yeah. so now just coming down to where the cricket club is like they've finished all the matches for the season now so they've just got the square uh, positioned off to so the cover so Yeah. So here we've got the, the the nets down here, the practice nets, just here at this end. You can see them. And then uh, that's the square which has been marked off with a little fencing. So the last match was like late September. It's the scoreboard. So you can easily like. Uh, just watch it, just watch, look at it from up, up here from the road, watch a match or whatever you want to, but uh, or then uh, people in the flats can have a nice view of a cricket. So we're just on the final stretch now, coming down towards the Homestead Estate and Bear Left. <laughs> 